This video is meant for visual support during installation. Use the provided manual for full installation instructions. Installers in this video are licensed professionals. Vigo highly recommends using a licensed contractor to do this installation and will require a minimum of two people. Vigo has the right to update and modify this product. This is done with your best interest in mind as we will never stop striving for perfection. Using installation instructions as a reference, check hardware to make sure all pieces are present. For tech support, call this number. Replacing your shower door can be very easy. First, inspect your package and all of its contents before installation. Grab your two rails and drill tiny weep holes every six to nine inches on the upper inside portion. This will prevent water buildup. Attach the rails together tightly using the corner joint. Lay the rail square and firmly against both walls. Put the shorter rail where you want the door to open. Make sure they're level. Mark for your holes and then screw the rails down. Shower enclosure is made from tempered glass. If mishandled, it could potentially shatter. Never rest the glass directly on a hard surface and be careful not to bang it while moving. Now it's time to install the side panel. Always rest your panels on a piece of cardboard or something soft to avoid damage. Install the seal on the side that mounts to the wall. Mark if there's any excess, then cut it like so. After your seals, install the supports. These are made to be adjustable to easily level the panel. Put the panel on its rail. Hold it level, then mark for your holes. Afterwards, remove the panel and pre-drill your holes. Ideal Installation prefers the use of studs in place behind the walls. However, if these are not present, anchors are provided with the product. Put them in place and then tap them in flush with a rubber mallet. Have one person set the glass up level, then screw the mount to the wall. Install the seal strip on the other side of your panel, then install the ones on the door panel. Mark if there's any excess, then cut it off. Next, install your shims underneath the hinges to boost the door up and prevent sagging. After that, put your hinges in place and screw them to the door panel. Never fully tighten one screw before partially tightening the opposite. The hinges should open outwards. Repeat this process for the bottom hinge. For your next step, have one person hold the door up level while another marks for your holes. Move the door panel, then pre-drill your holes and insert your anchors. Put the door in place and screw the hinges to the wall firmly. At this point, both panels should be level. Next, place your structural arm with the wall connector about two-thirds of the way from the back wall and make it level. Remove the arm and mark for your hole through the middle of the wall connector. Pre-drill your hole, then insert an anchor and put everything back in place. Tighten appropriately with a hex key. Install the door's bottom seal strip. Then, screw the handle in place. Installation can be done on either side depending on your preference. Apply silicone along the inside of the shower floor and walls to help keep it watertight. All that's left is to apply the hinge and hex screw covers. For best results and to keep your shower looking brand new, wipe it down with a glass cleaner regularly. We also recommend using a water beading treatment on the inside of your panels, similar to one you'd use to treat your car windshield to bead the water off and prevent watermarks. That's all we have for today. See you next time.